Okay, we're rolling. What we're going to do, I just want to tell you how to make Cura so that you have control over your settings. At the moment, I have two printers, a, um, a one-ho and another printer I built myself. And I've got my one-ho set up here, right? And I've got brim set to brim width, three brims, okay? And so I'm going to save this project, even though there's no model in it. And I'm going to save it in my setting saves. And H one ho D four. Okay, I'm saving that there as this is a printer setup rather than Okay, that's been saved. And there we have it. And there we have it. That's what we just saved. Okay, now I'm going to open my other printer. Open files, setting saves, and we want the cart. I'm going to open that, and here we're going to update cart and update existing. So that's going to change all the settings that are in that file and bring those in for my printer. Okay, so I open that, and there we have. This is my other printer. It's got a different size bed. And now you can see the, sk the skirt's only got two, two line count now and it had three before. So I'm going to delete these things because I don't need those. And I'm going to save this. Save project. And I'm just going to call this one I call this printer cart short for Cartesian so I'm going to save that now we'll open the folder and have a look so now we've got our one ho d4 that I just saved and our cart so there are two saves I've done and now I can just go open project well I can just open it from here and see it's update existing, update one, and notice two, open. And there we go. We've now got a brim count of three and we've got our one ho bed size. And that's how you change. Open recent and we'll go back to cart. Make sure you've got update existing and update cart. And this way you never lose your settings in Cura, which happened to me all the time until I figured this out. Okay, good to go.